Hello, brothers and sisters of light and dark. Welcome, welcome, welcome to my page. My page is about common sense. I try my best to keep it simple as possible. I try to skip all of the jargon and scientific terms. Because even though, you know, I know a lot of y'all geeks out there like to hear the technical terms and where I got my sources from, I'd just rather you do it yourself, you know, do the research yourself, you know. It's really not all that necessary, all that important. But if you have any questions, you put it below. All right? Okay. Um, this video is going to be about who's mentally ill, okay, and the consequences of it, okay. Now, you first, first understand, okay, that when I say thank you very much for brothers and sisters of light and dark, I'm talking about light and dark, okay. It's positive in the light, and it's positive in the dark. Okay, there's also positive in between, okay. Okay, now let me go on to my subject now here, okay. Um, mentally ill means that no matter... If you think you're normal, okay, you are mentally ill, okay, because this world is intended to be cursed. If you may think that you're normal, but you're really not normal, but it goes like this, okay, let me do that little line thing again, okay, if you're more for the left, okay, you will, see, it may, this, this screen may be reversed or flipped, okay, so, if you're more for the left, you're a follower, okay, and most followers are mentally ill because they're either religious or they follow other people because they need attention okay okay this whole video is proving my point where how everyone is mentally ill it doesn't matter which way you go to okay so society would dub you as when you're a follower you're normal okay if you're social you're normal but you technically are mentally ill because you have to follow other people in order to feel content okay about this life no matter which way you go about it contentness means that if a doctor sees you and you're not socializing, he will think that you were most likely mentally ill. Okay? All right? But in reality, some people are actually social because they need to be social because they don't want to be alone. Okay? The more religious you become, the more mentally ill you are. But a lot of people in society don't think you're mentally ill. See? All right? You understand that? Okay. The logically say you're not supposed logic says that you're not supposed to be religious, okay? But people who are faith-based and believe in an invisible God, okay, are mentally ill, okay, technically, okay. And then there are those who are in the middle, who don't believe in nothing, okay. Void. I've met people like that. I've met very few people like that. Very fucking interesting, man. I met this, I met a few guys who basically had nothing in their rooms. They didn't care about nothing. All they, all they was doing was wait for death. It was like the goddamn Buddha. They don't care for nothing. They don't care about women. Okay, they didn't care about they, they didn't have nothing wrong with their penis. I asked them, I said, something wrong with your penis? You know, they don't care about nothing, man. They don't even watch no TV. I seen guys like that. I was like, yo, that's that's deep to me, man. Right in the middle. I can't do that. Okay. I can't just sit there and do nothing. And just rot the fuck away. And the only thing they eat is fucking drink water and fucking rice and beans. That's just, that's spiritual, that's probably true spirituality, to be right in the middle, okay? And then there's those on the right, because I'm more on the right, okay? True spiritual, true logical. That's, that's, that leads to insanity, okay? Isolation, okay? Desolation, okay? You know, it keeps you antisocial. I'm very incendric on who I choose in my circle, okay? It's always low, it always stays very low. And if that person just makes it the wrong turn, I just cut them, okay? While the other side is socializing, people forgive easily, okay? You get what I'm saying? There's a disciplined side. There's a socialized side, okay? And everybody's fucking mentally ill, okay? And then that's where you got these doctors or the quacks, okay? Who feel they're truly logical to break everyone free, okay? So they really are quackers themselves because they want to try to help everybody. I try to help people and I'm still quackers, okay? <laughs> but let me see. There's people with God complexes. Who believe they're better than other people? Uh, we call it uh, what do you call it? Napoleon, Napoleon complex. I heard. Okay, uh, people who are not really funny, like Kevin Hart. Okay, who basically you know you know popular funny. Okay, you know what I'm saying. I'm just like that's that's crazy. There's a whole bunch of different stereotypes and labels. Okay, the more knowledge you seek, the more insane you go. Okay, because you don't fit in with anybody. You're an alien or some shit. The more you fit in with other people, then you're more religious. You know, emotional based. Okay. You know, you're expendable when you get on the emotional side. You're not expendable when you're non-emotional, okay? 
Let me see. Uh, there's slave thinkers in the world. She like to break things down, try to figure out the universe, mathematics. Because I'm mental, you. I hear fucking voices. I'm a, I'm actually on an abstract page. You know? I actually hear a fucking voice talking to me. Three to four, five of them, six of them. Can't go to fucking sleep sometimes. Okay, I'm on the way. I'm way more intelligent than, than all three stages. I'm on the third stage. Okay? I hear shit. They tell me what to do. I go up there. I go up to the hill and get me a car because of a voice fucking tells me there's something to do. And you don't hear that. You don't hear nothing. Okay, man, you're you're mentally ill. You have a block, okay? But that's what I wanted to say to you, brothers and sisters. Everybody's mentally ill. This video is called Who's Mentally Ill, okay? And what category do you fit in? Do you think you're special? Okay, you know what I heard? I read okay, somewhere, okay? That on the other side is perfect. There is no need to, uh, everything is a thought and everything is created by thought. On the other side is perfect, okay? But even on the other side, could you be mentally ill? No, because everything is about the universe and energy. Okay, so there's really no, uh, you know, thought process too much, okay? It's just something you, you, you learned or experienced, okay? This is a cursed world. This is a nightmare world, okay? We're here as a test, okay? A testimony to give a story. Some people lived in past lives, and they were a roach, or they're an ant, okay? Or they're a tire, okay? So that's another level of thinking there. But everybody's mentally ill, especially if you look at the higher-ups, the true logical individuals, okay? So peace and love to you, brothers and sisters of light and dark. You gotta understand, okay? No one's actually normal, okay? And if you do consider yourself normal with the normal socializing, then you are truly insane, okay? You are not a logical person. Not a person of common sense neither, okay? Everybody's mentally ill in this world, okay? The ants is fucking mentally ill. Unless their minds is very little, like minute, okay? But that's insanity there. They can't even think on a higher level. And you got the white man. The cockroach always trying to think on a higher level. The Chinese man trying to copy off the white man, okay? The yellow man, okay? The red man. The black man, okay? You know what I'm saying? Peace and love to you, brothers. This is of light and dark. Peace. And don't smoke too much, okay? Get out of that shit. Pull up your pants, okay? Take off the bandanas. We shall all come together as one, like kumbaya, okay? And the sky shall open and, and scroll, okay? And the aliens will come down and pick us up and take us to the other world. The Indians said that there was a portal on a rock. Okay, and that was lost. Peace and love to you, brothers and sisters of light and dark. <laughs> That's some shit for your ass, right? <laughs> and no, I'm not high, okay? Peace and love to you, brothers and sisters of light and dark, okay?